Any thoughts on how I can deal with management's need of long-term planning in a complex environment and complex work? Oh, I, <laughs> I just released a blog on that one. Yeah, yeah. let's get a link to that in the chat. Todd, yeah, let me find, I, I, I put a blog out there that I got a lot of inboxes about, some of which were not all that kind, <laughs> to tell you the truth. My, the blog title is The False Sense of Security of Release Plans. And I've, I, I detail in there a time when I was asked to create a release burndown chart and how a lot of management was asking me about where teams were at with the commitments that they were supposed to. And uh, I talk about basically how the report was just completely BS. It was there to appease management. And all they cared about was that chart. And I would try to, during a sprint review, me and the product owner would try to talk about, hey, we shipped this into production and people are using it, feedback from the, and they'd be like, can we see the chart? Where's the team at? Where are their commitments? And uh, so this was quite some time ago, 10 years ago that, that I was asked to do this. And I started cataloging and thinking about all the times that I was asked to create a long-term plan. Uh, and all of the time and effort from myself and the team and the people involved in it and all the conversations about it with the really objective reality of it is we didn't know and we're wasting a ton of time building those long-term release plans when we could have been using that time to build our hypothesis to be tested in production. And, and, I feel like there's just been hundreds of thousands of dollars wasted on tools and everything from the fact that we, we don't know. And I think that we could do a lot better of a job setting expectations, setting expectations that we don't know, instead of just lying to ourselves and everybody else. I understand that you have to come up with strategies for marketing. There's some of the go to jail stuff that you have to do by a given date. In my experience, is a lot of the stuff for marketing is able to be a little bit more agile. Maybe marketing can operate with you with a little bit of agility. As far as go to jail stuff, why wait to do it? Just get it done. Just finish it. Just do it. Don't put it seven sprints from now or whatever you're thinking in your long-term uh, strategy. I, I know this line of thought is new and clearly upsets people given my inbox and my LinkedIn. The death threats were a little extreme people. Can <laughs> yeah. we tone it down? It's just a blog post. Yeah, it was pretty wild to see the feedback. Now, there's not a lot of comments. There's no comments on the article. People just, just a lot of grumbling. It, grumble, yeah, people grumble, took grumble. it personally. People took it personally. And I'm like, but then I dig in a little bit. And I'm just like, so the plan that you have right now is going to go exactly the way you think it is. No. Why the heck spend the time creating it? Yeah, exactly. Because we're being asked to. Okay. So do it as quickly and as effortlessly as possible because it's going to be wrong tomorrow. 